So I want to welcome you all. Thank you all for coming to the time of celebration for Mike Zioli and Sarah Ackerman as they make public their commitment and their love for each other. Most of you know me, but for those of you that don't, I'm Terry Ackerman. I'm the care pastor at Lockport Christian Church. But more importantly, I'm Sarah's mom. Hi. Hi. Hey. What's up? <laughs> I'm like so nervous. Yeah? Yeah. Why not? Why are you nervous? I don't know. <laughs> We've seen each other. <laughs> I know. <laughs> you look different. Yeah? Yeah. Fancy. Yeah. That's a nice light. Do you promise to love, respect, and protect each other from this day forward? Do you promise to accept responsibility of being a family and to encourage and support each other in your new lives together? Love is the most powerful tool we have. It is the one weapon that can break open the hardest of hearts and how much more powerful it is when you unite two hearts together in love. You can say all the right things, but if you say it out of obligation, out of duty, out of expectation, and not out of love, it will sound offensive. You can be smart and skilled and have a great understanding and even have faith to face the challenges in life but without love, when all is said and done, you will end up feeling alone, unimportant, and without impact. Sarah, it wasn't too long ago that your younger, younger brother Pat told me to, told you to stay <laughs> far away from me. I can say I'm glad you didn't listen to him. He was only looking out for what he thought was in your best interest. Mike, I remember the first time we met and leaving the boat dock with the feeling of wanting to know more about the boy in the red shorts. You are unlike anyone I have ever met and you have gotten to know me better than anybody has and somehow you still managed to love me. A little bit of history today in the ceremony. Back in 1972, that's 47 years ago, you don't have to get your calculators out, uh, Terry and I were married. The, uh, the dress she was, uh, she used in the, in the, wait a minute, I'm sorry, uh, we're married. The dress she wore was used in the making of her granddaughter's London's dress and a part of it was sewn in Sarah's dress. So it went down the aisle again. <laughs> okay, we're gonna have a little blessing here. <clears throat> Dear Lord, we gather in, the, in this place in a spirit of celebration and, and gratitude. We thank you for bringing Mike and Sarah together in a marriage today. And we want to bless this food we're about to receive and let this reception be an honor to you guys. Thank you. 
I'm gonna keep this nice and short and sweet, but I just wanna say thanks. And for everybody that came out and took the time to be part of this uh, this wedding and be part of every, I don't know, I screwed this up. <laughs> Mom, my mom is the sweetest, nicest, awesomest mom you could ask for. If I had a different mom, I would say I want a real mom. I love all the things. I love all the things you did for me, as much as I love grilled cheese and pizza. So much. <laughs> Some of my favorite memories with you are eating grilled cheese every day when I was a kid for lunch and, and sometimes for dinner. <laughs> we clean together and I think of it as a game. Whenever the ice cream truck goes by Whenever the ice cream truck goes by I go outside with my mom to get ice cream. I go on bike rides with my mom. We do crafts eighty times a day. Mike picks out the best movies. Mike and I play hockey and wrestle together. He taught me how to ride my bike with no training wheels. I am happy Mom and Mommy and Mike are married so we can do more things as a family. We will be making a house together. I now have two dads. Mom and Mike, thanks for getting the best baby brother and maybe a sister or another brother. <laughs> Or a hamster and any animal except a dog or a cat. We love you, love London and Mason. Where you move, make me blind. You will always be there. There's no doubt in my mind. You will always be the heading out to see ya and leave the rest behind. Cause you make me feel like Yeah, you make me 